hello guys i trust you're all doing super well so why don't we jump into the fascinating world of artificial intelligence or what we call the generative ai so if you are ready let's jump right on it whether you are creating a stunning art writing like a pro composing music or even producing a video generative ai is reshaping how we create and interact with media and i know you won't doubt me i totally believe that you are on the same page with me on this one but just in case you are not i will take my time to explain everything step by step so let's get started generative ai refers to the type of artificial intelligence that can generate new content from images to test music or even videos based on some patterns it learns from the huge data set that it has access to imagine teaching a robot how to paint by giving it access to a huge data repository right guess what will happen the robot will learn how to create its own unique masterpieces but wait, how does generative AI actually work? Let me explain to you. At the heart of a generative AI are the algorithms called neural networks, which actually mimics how human brain works or function, right? It's just like how our neural senses connected to each other. Basically, that's how the whole thing or uh, yeah, the whole structure of the algorithm is created to behave, all right, or react. This network analyzes heaps of data to understand styles and trends, all right, and then use the same knowledge to produce new original works, all right. It's like how you learn how to cook by trying different recipes, and all of a sudden, you create your own unique recipe that can only be attributed to you. I hope I'm making sense. Basically, inventing your own dish by learning so much about recipes and how they combine to form a specific da, da, da. I don't know. I'm not. I don't like cooking. So, but I hope you get my point, right? Applications like Dali E, CapCut, or even Microsoft Copilot. There are so much applications out there. Can create unique images just from test prompts or some kind of description. For example, create an image of a young lady in a Ghanaian t-shirt walking on the streets of lagos all right while holding ghanian color bag all right basically then boom you have that image with just that description that is not all tools like chat gpt3 chat gpt4 cloud ai among so many ai tools out there can actually write great articles blogs poems music raps or even some codes based on what it has learned so far from the data repository it has access to ai systems like jukebox can actually create an entire music whether being afrobeat hip-hop jazz whatever it can actually create unique music that you can maybe sell i don't know it can even prompt you to create music like stevie wonder or any musician that you can think any popular musician you can think of on the surface of the earth and ai can actually compose and create music in that particular person's style as if that's not enough ai can now actually create deepfake like videos all right like myself you wouldn't even identify that i'm speaking who knows could be an ai or robot speaking to you but hey i'm real like i'm echo i'm real open ai recently introduced its own new model called the sora all right sora actually with a prompt can create an entire video an entire movie like i guess three or five minutes movie full movie trailer like you wouldn't even know the cast in that particular movie are real people or i mean created by ai you wouldn't even know okay so that's how should i say dangerous that's how disruptive ai is becoming or has become Ha! Ah, so yes, let's talk about how this AI can actually benefit you and how you can leverage AI to scale your business, to make some money or I mean, do pretty much everything that you want to, okay? The benefits of generative AI are huge. It boosts creativity, saves time and opens up new possibilities for artists, writers, musicians, filmmakers. It's a tool that actually is opening up doors for anyone with little creativity to, I mean, create spectacular, uh, creative, uh materials or items that possible they can even sell to make some money all right if you are not good at writing you can now become a good writer if you are not good with creating i mean graphics you can now if you understand how ai works and know how to use the right prompts you can actually create best or great images for stocks or you can even create graphics and sell to people i mean there is so much possibility with this generative ai and i think um we have to kind of um start some master class on what do you think all right if you believe or you think i should start master class on ai and how to leverage ai to make money just comment yes i want you to all right other than that is something that i believe you should have a fair knowledge on all right but hey generative ai is not without challenges let's be fair issues like copyright infringements uh privacy concerns 
or even potential of misuse by people especially they fake can i mean create some issue discourse in our society so please if you are learning how to use ai learn it to use it in the right way just like gun someone can use gun to hunt for food others can use the guns the same gun to rob all right someone can use gun to protect their family other can use the same gun to attack people so it depends on how you use ai to um for yourself all right i believe you're going to use it for the right purpose so guys that's it for today if you find this video useful you can just like my video you can follow me on tiktok or you can subscribe to my channel on youtube until next time i'll see you in the next video bye